What's up, deputies? Officer, first 30 minutes here. Hope everybody's having an awesome Friday. Just before I begin the stream, I want to say if you are in South Carolina in an evacuation zone, move out. This hurricane looks like it's going to hit Charleston, almost potentially um, hit land. So I just wanted to say that word of advice. Um, I'm good. I'm out, I'm in South Carolina, but I'm outside of a evacuation zone, so I should be safe. Just a lot of heavy rain and some heavy wind tonight and tomorrow. So today we are patrolling. It's been a while since we've done a live stream patrol. We're using the Renault. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's a French manufacturer, um, Sport RS Interceptor. This is created by game 68240 so big shout out to him he's got a youtube channel he does um mounting tutorials but he's a french youtuber so i recommend it if you guys uh, like that type of videos you're in georgia but you're barely outside the zone yeah it's coming close to that georgia coast as well all right, so let's take a look at the car before we begin today's patrol. Roger, dispatch. We are en route. It just came out today. It's pretty interesting. It's a police version of this, essentially what is a track car. I'm pretty sure this would be a supercar in, um, in France or whatever markets it's in it. Uh, Renault is not sold in American markets. Um, I think they sell in Mexico. Well, I should say um, United States markets. They might sell in Mexico and um, other parts of the Americas, but not in the U.S. I think they were selling in the U.S. at one point, but um, it's been maybe 30, 40 years since then. It really only has two LED police lights. You can see them right there in the grill. And they don't alternate or anything. It's just um, in unison, they blink together. So it's pretty interesting to see it. That's what it looks like. As you can see, it blinks together. It strobes, the headlight strobe. And then the back, we've got alternating um, LED brake lights and a strobe effect. And that's it for the emergency lightings. There's no light bar on the top or anything. So very interesting. Let's take a look on the inside of the vehicle. It's it's really well done. So you, there you can see game 68240's YouTube page. He puts it on the all his police laptops and his mods. There's a gun holster there in the passenger side seat. We've got a digital speedometer that is functional. Works awesome. We've got police radio right there next to the lap laptop so obviously this is not a very realistic police car but it, they're still fun to patrol in so today we are highway patrol we've got our high visibility jacket on as well as our san andreas highway patrol hats you can see it right there Not impressed with the lighting. <laughs> well, I, I've noticed uh, European police cars, they seem not to go as, I don't know if you want to call it overboard, but they don't seem to put as many uh, emergency lights on their police vehicles. So that's probably why it's uh, kept to a minimum. All right, so let's go ahead. I think we should start off with a little speed patrol here. We are, I'll show you where we are on the map. This is, uh, you, I think we're Interstate 1, headed, looks like eastbound. So let's go ahead, pull up our speed radar. Anything over 70 is going to flag. Um, sometimes we can get other flags such as registration. And we just got our first speeder. Going to be that gauntlet right in front of us. So we'll go ahead, catch up, and pull him over. Oh my goodness come into a halt right there in the middle of the roadway it's gonna pull it over 
he came to a stop super quick. All right, so Lincoln 18 will be 1038 with this gauntlet. Let's go ahead, run a plate check on it. See if it comes back with any flags. Uh, plate number is going to be 00 Lincoln, Henry Queen, 524. Suspect license plate, 00 Lincoln, Henry Queen, 524, no 1099. All right, no flags on the vehicle. Looks like it's just occupied one time. So we'll go ahead and proceed with that. Let's make contact with the driver. I really like these wings. I think they're called gold wings, how the door opens up. All right, so we noticed trash on the floorboards. Driver seems angry. How are you doing today, ma'am? I'm officer first 30 minutes with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. Pulled you over today for speeding. You're going 71 in a 60. Can I go ahead and get your driver's license? Yep, Bob. All right, we got a Jack Jeffries. Her name is Jack. Interesting. All right, let's get back in the car and we're gonna run her name. How fast can the car go? Um, we might be able to test that out later, but I was playing around with it earlier and it uh, got up over 100 miles per hour. Speed works a little differently in the games. All right. So she's been stopped three times, no active warrants. All right. So that's all good. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and issue her a citation for today. Just a citation, issue ticket. We're gonna do a $200 fine for speeding. We're not gonna seize the vehicle, issue the ticket. This car is a Renault Sport RS Interceptor. It's a French um, car by a French manufacturer. It was just released on GTA5-mods.com today. If you're new to Twitch, welcome. I see a lot of new usernames. All right, that traffic stop is done. I'm doing great today, Fire Buff. Just gonna ride out this hurricane. Should get some heavy winds and some rain, but everything should be okay. How do you subscribe on YouTube? Just hit the sub subscribe button. It's pretty simple. All right, let's go ahead, pull on the street and set up another radar zone down the interstate. I think we're gonna pull over here and run some radar as well. Yeah, what's up, Xbox Gamer, that Chamant MD, Creeper Boss, Connor, John, good to see you, man. All right, so it's going to be the same thing, 70 miles per hour. Like I said, we also can hit just various flags on the vehicles as they go past. Sometimes they might have a suspended license. Like that, Saber, we'll let them go though. I forgot all the flags. I think you can even get stolen flags. Oh, this vehicle just about wrecked. He just blew a tire. We'll go ahead and get him off the roadway here. Yep, he's smoking. All right, he's pulling over. Get him off the roadway. No, I don't want to cancel the stop. All right, let's get him off the roadway. <laughs> Come on. For some reason we keep canceling. 
trying to get him off the roadway here. It's just dangerous for him to be stopped in the middle of the interstate. There we go. All right. Control Q. All right. So we've got a Granger here. He just had a blowout on the interstate. Looks like the vehicle is occupied two times. We're going to run the plate. And we will see what it comes back as. No tap. Proceed with caution. What if you hide behind a bridge? Are you talking about the hurricane? Um, I guess that would work. You you need something very structurally sound. And <laughs> drink that water. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead and talk to the driver and make sure they're okay. Not really going to give them a ticket. It was mainly for their safety that we pulled them over because they had that's a blow on the road. All right. How you doing, sir? I am Officer First Sergeant Mintz with San Andreas Highway Patrol. Notice you had a blowout back there. Just want to make sure everything's okay with you. Um, I am going to need your driver's license, though. Just want to make sure we're not dealing with somebody's got warrants out on them. All right, Jackie, stay put. We're gonna have to get a tow truck out here. We got a Jack Matthews, or I mean a Jackie. Where am I getting Matthew? I'm reading the chat and it's confusing me. Not Hurricane Matthew, Jackie Coolers. All right, two times stop, no active warrants. All right, so we're gonna have to ask him to exit the vehicle and then we're gonna call a tow truck for him. All occupants out of the vehicle. All right, they're both out. Um, let's see if I can call a taxi for them both. That, actually, we might have to finish the traffic stop and then I can call a taxi. So we'll get a tow truck first, come pick up their car, get it off the road. Alright, I guess they're gonna walk. They opted to to walk from the scene, so Granger's been impounded. We'll be uh off that traffic stop. The dog, she is uh she's wandering around somewhere. <laughs> one related death to the hurricane was from a heart attack. I didn't even know that. I heard there's one death in Florida, but I didn't know it was um heart attack related. I mean, that is a factor to consider because if you have a medical emergency during a hurricane, you're pretty much um, out of luck, unfortunately. I know in South Carolina, I think um, if winds are over 30 miles per hour, um, no emergency vehicles are going to be out on the roadway. It's just not safe for them to be out in that type of wind speed. All right, we'll head down the road and we'll set up another speed radar. What is the dog gonna be for Halloween? She's gonna be a hot dog. Get it, a hot dog? <laughs> All right, let's see if we catch any speeders. No, I'm gonna, any other flags, unless it's a stolen vehicle, I'm gonna go ahead and just ignore so we can focus on doing um, speeding. And Obama coming in with a $1 donation. He says, hi, FTM. Love your vids. Keep up the good work. Appreciate it, Obama. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> Thank you for your donation, man. Let's see what we find. Everybody's going to speed limit. So speed limit 60. I'm setting it to go off. Anything above 70 miles per hour, just to give them a little cushion, because I'm nice. But that gauntlet, we just got another gauntlet speeding here. He was going 77. Oh my gosh. 
What's this bike doing? All right, what is this bike up to? Let's let's check this out. I was going after the gauntlet, but this bike just cut in front of that truck. See fleeing? I think he might be fleeing. There we go. He's gonna pull over. Alright. Oh now he puts on this helmet. After he's been over after he's been pulled over, he puts on this helmet. Alright. So the Lincoln 18 should be 1038 with a bagger motorcycle. Let's run a plate check on him. Plate number is 66 Charles Bob X ray 930. Vehicles occupied one time. Oh my goodness, didn't mean to hit that horn. Did I make the logo and intro myself? I did not. Mm. Register owners, license um, is coming back as suspended. So if this guy is Jack Hoff, um, he might be getting a ticket. Mahali Papas, thank you for the one dollar donation. Hi FTM, I have missed a lot of your vids and I'm trying to catch up. I just want to say you're one of the greatest YouTubers. Keep up the good work. Hey, I appreciate that. Thank you for the kind words and the donation. Much appreciate it. All right, so let's go ahead, talk to this guy on the motorcycle. See what's going on. Um, he's got a closed alcohol container in the console. I don't know how we're seeing that, but that's what the menu's pulling up. But it is closed container, so I'm not too worried about that. How you doing today, sir? Officer, first 30 minutes with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. Pulled you over today for a little bit of reckless driving. I saw you swerve in front of a truck back there. Can I go ahead and get your driver's Hello. license? Yep, Jack Hoff, he's a registered owner, so we already know this is going to come back as a suspended license. Alright, let's go ahead and run him in the database. Let's confirm the uh, plate reading. I think we'll do another limited offering on the t-shirt. But this is what it looks like. If you guys can see it, there you go. You can see it. Um, I think in the coming weeks, a little before Christmas, we'll do like a two week offering of the t shirt if anyone is interested in it. So this guy, he has no active warrants, but he's got a suspended license. So um, that's not good. He's driving on a suspended license. So we can. Um, proceed a couple of different ways depending on what you guys um, think we should do so for one I'm not gonna let him drive the motorcycle away because he's got a suspended license he shouldn't be driving um, we can either arrest him for the driving on the suspended license um, I will say he's been pretty cordial he's not causing me any problems pulled over um, pretty well or we can um, just let him off with a fine and anyway his his motorcycle is going to get impounded so I'll let you guys decide if we should let him off just with a citation and his vehicle um, will get seized you can put one in the chat and then two in the chat will mean he gets arrested How often do I do live streams? I haven't done too many lately. I've been trying to do at least one a week though, lately. Best way to get in contact with me is uh, just tweet at me on Twitter. Easiest way. Let them off with a fine. So one, two, <laughs> this is actually three. No, kill him's not an option. Three is not an option. Um. It's pretty even mix. I'd say one's kind of outweighing everybody. So we're gonna ask him off the vehicle and then we're just gonna impound his motorcycle. I think that's what we're gonna do today. 
Alright. It's gonna get off the vehicle. Actually, I, I've never tried this before. I wanna try it. So, there's an option to seize the vehicle here when you give a ticket. So, we'll do a um, $400 fine. It's really a careless driving offense, but the reason is suspended license. I just see expired, but it's technically suspended. Oh, we we have a we have a dollar donation from Donald Trump. He says, "Love your videos. Keep up the good work and vote for me for president." He says, "Make America great again." All right, thank you, Donald. Um, we'll do we'll do the careless driving and we'll seize the vehicle. I want to see what happens. And then let's go ahead and issue that ticket. How many people are watching? I, I think about 150, 155. And look, he's getting off his vehicle and then automatically the tow trucks mm -hmm. coming in the box truck to pick up that motorcycle. That's pretty cool. I, I didn't know that's what happened. Minimum moderator age, um, probably 16 and up, I would say. I, I went through all those applications from last time, so if you applied, I appreciate it. Um, I added three new moderators, and if you were a new moderator, you would have received a message from me. All right, so that is concluded. Let's go ahead switch up the pace a little bit and make ourselves 10-8 available for calls. We'll sit here on the side of the road till we get some calls coming in. Yeah, if you want to see uptime, just um, exclamation mark uptime and Moobot should tell you how long I've been streaming for. How many live streams have I done? A bunch. I'm not sure exact number though. Alright, we got a robbery. Heights. In Marietta Heights, please respond to a robbery at a supermarket. All right, so let's look at the call details here before we go off to the location. Reports of a robbery in progress. Weapons are involved. No units currently on scene. So we're going to go ahead and respond to that. Code 3, Lincoln 18. Copy that. Responding code 3. Show me 1076 en route. Let's go ahead and get there. Here's that first person view with that digital speedometer. Looks pretty, pretty nice. You can see the game, it tops out at 100 and something, but I'm sure this car in real life could go much, much quicker. Hop out to third person and get to the scene. Actually, oh my gosh, I'm about to crash into so many people. I want us to cut through and get off the exit. So I guess we're gonna have to do this. Wow, this is dangerous. Oh my gosh, uh, I just caused a, uh, a little pile up there. Oh, this GPS. I am so sorry, AI drivers. I am causing a huge traffic scene. All right, let's get to the scene. <laughs> uh, probably just cause about six, probably five or six car pile up right there. All right, let's get over here. Here's the location of that supermarket. Lincoln 18, we are 1023 on scene. Let me go in. Guns out here. We got some pedestrians just chilling outside. All right, uh, we got a robber in there. He says, come any near and I'll kill you both. Let's get some SWAT backup on scene. I'm gonna take a position behind my police car. All right, somebody's coming out. All right, we got shots fired. I just got hit. He's fleeing the scene. He is armed. He's firing off his gun. 
We got backup in route. Drop the gun. He's not dropping it. He is just shooting off shots. Man, he has a lot of health. He must have some type of body armor. All right. Um, I don't know if there's somebody else in here, but we're going to head in and clear out the store. Pull out our shotgun for this. Is anybody else in here? All right, from the store's queer. Did he kill the quirk? All right, quirk's down. We're gonna go ahead, call EMS to the scene once it's been queered. All right, store room is queer as well. Let's check back here. All right, queer. All right, all queer. Let's get EMS on scene. Um, we've got two injured parties here. We got one quirk who's down, and then. We've got um, the gunman. He's down as well. I'm going to go ahead and collect his weapon for evidence. Go ahead, put down some cones or some police do not cross signs. I got hit in the arm there. We'll go ahead and pretend when EMS arrives that they clean me up, patch me up in my armor. Yeah, you can um also leave a post on Facebook. Oh, <laughs> that paramedic just got knocked down by the car. All right, we got one injured inside. Oh, he just broke that. We'll see if any of them are going to be revived. Yeah, I think that would be a pretty cool implementation because normally, I mean, I'm not very good at this game, so <laughs> look at the ambulance. Normally, I uh, will get shot up a little bit. All right, they're both going to be um, dead on scene, so we're going to have to call the corner out. How, how did this happen? Is somebody in there? No. All right. I should have shut down the street. So we'll have to get a tow truck. Here's a door from the ambulance. All right, corners taking pictures. That vehicle's been towed out of the uh, path. We'll wait for them to take pictures and then um, this scene will be clear all right we'll go ahead remove the barriers remove all signs That, so this is not a police Tahoe, it's actually um, the firefighter's Tahoe. But better EMS, whatever vehicle you have in the FBI 2 slot, it just um, makes it red and then the firefighters use that car. So we'll be code 4 off of this call. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code 4. No further units required. I got a good question. Somebody asked how often my game crashes from all the mods um depends some mods do we have a pursuit oh we got a pursuit going on here we got an active pursuit i'm gonna assist this um officer here oh we got shots being fired oh, of course he's fast he's really fast We got two occupants who bailed out of that car. Let's see if I can get a taser out. Um, how often does it crash? Not too often. 
that's the answer to the to the question. Oh, what? Speak of the <laughs> really? What the heck? Dude, you jinxed it. You straight up jinxed that. That was that was that was good. That was really good. All right, let's go ahead and reload the game. I'm not on the latest raid hook yet because a lot of people haven't updated their mods. Yeah, that's Captain 14's um, unreleased Ford Police Interceptor utility. It's It should come out soon. I think he's waiting on one additional mod and then that pack will be complete it <laughs> yep rip rip rest and pepperonis <laughs> you're sorry you brought it up <laughs> don't worry it, it does crash sometimes I don't I don't know why I crashed in that instance but it did something um it I I did something the game didn't like. Welcome to the stream, Sam Crow. I'm glad you found it. What's going on, bunch? What's up, King? What's up, Saint? I'm doing good, Robo Dog. You can see how long it takes to load the game. Those are all the plugins I'm currently using in my game. All right, so this is you can you guys can uh, see what I have to do every time before I go on patrol. So normally I load into the EUP menu. Um, today we're doing highway patrol and we're in the jacket uniform, so that's that. The vehicle we're using today, it's installed in its own um, separate. Oh my goodness, um, separate. DLC containers, so that's why I have to type it in manually. And then we go ahead and hit F4 to load into um, Rage plugin hook. And I normally just go ahead and force duty like that. It loads all our call outs. And then I put max armor to emulate us wearing some body armor. And then that's it. We're we're already on duty, so we're gonna head back to the interstate, and we'll take um, some more callouts. How long before Matthew hits? I think South Carolina is predicted to get hit um, early Saturday morning. It's such a slow-moving storm. Yeah, it doesn't crash much, and then it then it crashes. That would happen. Alright, let's head back to the interstate. I think we can, there's a non-ramp over here. Ooh, special drink. Let's take a left here. I used to have a pretty cool turn signal mod installed. And I loved using the turn signals, but lately I've had a couple mods that just interfere with that. So I went ahead and just completely disabled it. All right, let me check one setting real quick. All right, perfect. All right, so we should be back on patrol here. Let's see if we get some more call outs. So it doesn't take too long to get set up again. Actually, we're gonna head over this way. Simple Trainer has a turn signal mod. Yeah, I know there are a lot of um, turn signal mods. I just, I like using a controller personally to play. So, there are not too many button combinations that aren't already being used up by my controller. And I hate to have conflicting stuff. What's going on, Justin? Glad you could join the stream. 
Thanks for using your Prime subscription on me. I appreciate it. We got a bicycle on the freeway. Oh yeah, that's a good call out. Okay. Ensure the safety of the public and keep traffic following, flowing. Wow, I cannot read. All right, let's see where he is. Up, oh, he's coming up here. He's on a bicycle. <laughs> he is on a bicycle. All right, let's go ahead and pull him over. He's fleeing. He's fleeing on his bicycle. We got a bicycle in pursuit. Uh, we're westbound on US Route 15. Speeds about 10 miles per hour. He's, he's trying to flee from police. We'll go ahead and turn on our sirens. Vehicles <laughs> occupied one time. I don't, I don't know what he thinks he's going to get away. It's, it's impossible. Um, if the pursuit goes on long enough, we will get a pit from the autom automatic roadblock mod. So that might happen. Uh, I'll, I'll be interesting to see. I can't really, I can't pit him or anything. He's on a bicycle. Doesn't appear to be armed. He just doesn't want to stop for police. So, I mean, really right now, I'm more so protecting him from getting hit by a, a car. Obviously, you don't want a bicycle on the interstate. It's just a dangerous situation. I know if I call him back up, they're, they're going to be super aggressive. They're going to try to knock him off the bike. Maybe I can pull in front of him and see if he'll stop. <laughs> and off he goes. <laughs> so we're going, he's actually riding pretty fast. He's going about 20 miles per hour. He's now headed off uh, into downtown Los Santos. It's going to be a male occupant. He's got a blue shirt and um, some khaki shorts on. I know, sports car versus bicycle. <laughs> uh, I, I like that. I might use that for the, uh, the title of the video. Alright, here's our roadblock coming in. Roadblock units are straight ahead. Let's see if he if he stops. Nope, he's not gonna stop from the roadblock. He's actually headed now towards uh, La Puerta Freeway. Headed westbound. Now these other units, they should go ahead and join us in the pursuit. Let's see if he stops. Shoot the tires. <laughs> The tires are so thin. Let's see if he takes a ramp. I doubt it. Yeah, he didn't even take the ramp. That would have been pretty cool. Now I'm blocked in. Really? I am, I'm blocked in. Red car is blocking me in. There we go. All right, let's catch up. Shouldn't it <laughs> shouldn't it take us too long to catch up? Is he still on his bike? Yep, still on the bike. All right, let's try to get ahead and set something up ourselves. One car roadblock. All right, we got another roadblock up ahead. He's still not stopped. Oh, he's going to stop. Now he's running. 
All right, we've got a uh, foot pursuit now, eastbound on Interstate 5. Oh, he just got smacked by that truck, that post-off truck. Man, he got weighed out by that truck. All right, I need to keep him at gunpoint. I'm going to put up some barriers here for officer safety as well as um, suspect safety. All right. Lincoln 18, we've got one in custody here. Finally gave up. I've actually used an Audi R8 before. I'm gonna search his um, bicycle. See if he's got anything illegal on here. Like he, for him to run that much, he must have had something illegal on him or under the influence of some type of drug, I would think. All right, he just had a pet collar in there. So we'll go ahead and request for a tow truck to come for, <laughs> for this bicycle. It's going to get impounded. I'm actually going to move my unit a little off the roadway so we can keep one lane of traffic open. For that truck to come through. All right. It's been impounded. We'll go ahead and remove the roadblocks and we'll be code four off the bicycle on the freeway call. What an interesting call out. You don't know bikes had trunks or hoods. Yeah. I was searching all in that uh, bicycle and all I could find was a pet collar. All units, we are code four. All right, we're available for calls now. We're ten eight. Mm, we've got a uh, a garbage truck ahead of us. I don't know how well you guys can see it on the stream, but there's a steady stream of. Um, trash coming out causing some roadway hazards so we're gonna go ahead and pull this garbage truck over it looks like he's a little over capacity for his um, for his bed yeah he's all the way filled up we don't want stuff flying into the roadway and causing accidents a lot of um, trucks now they'll have like this netting that will go on top of that bed to prevent something like that from happening um kind of waiting for a spot to actually pull him over because i would like to pull him over and not block a whole lane of traffic but i don't know if that's going to be possible all right we're going to go ahead and pull him over make sure he sees us Oh man, so sketchy. Let's see if we can get him into the median. Let's try the median. Actually, I want him off this exit. Cut back a little. Right now I'm using the mimic me command to get him off the roadway. Yeah, if he just pulls over. That's good enough. We'll go ahead and run the plate real quick of the garbage truck. Make sure it comes back clean. Oh, man. I keep doing that. I've got the Xbox One Pro Controller. It's got some um, triggers on the back, and one of them's my horn. He's got a bench warrant. Oh, man. It's going to be a felony. It's going to be a felony stop right here. Um, we're going to go ahead and call in a unit to back us up on this one. Uh, dispatch, roll me an additional, please. We're going to be doing a felony stop. 
registered owner of the vehicle has a bench warrant now the driver might not be a registered owner but we don't have a way of knowing that so if we arrest one joshua graham he's going to be immediately arrested for that bench warrant bench warrant means he um simply didn't show up for a court hearing there's our other tow truck we used um last live stream is pretty cool I need some pedals. Yeah, I, I'm good with the Xbox One controller. I try to make it as simple as possible. There's already so many different key combinations you have to remember. So, looks like this Impala is going to back us up here for this felony stop. Pull out the guns. Um, We're going to have them. All right. I want them to move to that side of the vehicle and we're going to go ahead and the order the driver out of the vehicle. All right, driver out of the vehicle, hands in the air. Oh man. LSPD, don't make me shoot you. All right, on the ground. Go ahead and make the arrest. See if it, he's Joshua. Yep, Joshua Graham, you're under arrest. You got a bench warrant out. So we'll go ahead and search him right here. We'll have to get somebody else to transport him. We just don't have enough. We don't have enough room in our car. Does it work with a laptop? I guess if you had a powerful enough laptop, it, um, it could work. I just want to verify his warrant. Joshua Grant. Is that not his name? Graham. Yeah, okay, yep. He's won it, yep. So we'll go ahead and get transport out here. Yeah. Xbox controllers are great for um, playing driving games on the computer. It's my preferred way. But yeah, I'm sure people have played LSPDFR on their laptop before. Alright, let's go ahead and search this um, garbage truck. See if we can find anything. <laughs> With power comes responsibility. So long. Uh, we're trying to search it. If we can. All right, he had a weapon. He has sawn off shotgun in there. So we'll have to get a, a big tow truck out here to tow his vehicle away. So on Twitter today, I was talking to the author of this police mod right here and he told me he's working on a Ferrari police car. I'm not sure what model Ferrari, but um, tomorrow's episode, we should be able to do a patrol in a Ferrari, which I think will be awesome. Um, he's going to provide a link to download and everything. And then I think a week after I use it tomorrow, it's going to be up for the public. But um, this guy, Game68240, he's done a bunch of higher-end police cars. I did a whole exotic um, supercar police week a couple months back, and I was mainly using his vehicles. He's got a bunch of them. He's got a whole Need for Speed Hot Pursuit pack. All right, we'll uh, code four off of that traffic stop. Lincoln 18, go ahead, show us 10-8. Available for calls. All 
I try to keep it to the fictional GTA 5 police department. I get a lot of requests to do, you know, real life police departments. Um, RCMP, I get that one a lot. I get just random departments, but I, I like to stick to the fictional GTA 5 police department. So that's like um, LSPD, which is Los Santos Police Department. That's SAHP, San Andreas Highway Patrol. Then you have your counties. Um, you've got Blaine County Sheriff's Office. You've got Los Santos um, Sheriff's Department. And then you've got some other like fictional park ranger departments as well. We are going to pull off here and we'll just wait for our call out to come in. All right, back in just like that. Loving the stream, glad you are enjoying it. All right, we'll wait here for a call out. That's true. Um, do you say that, Philip? I did um, use NYPD just mainly because that car pack, it didn't have any. Um, what's the Liberty City Police Department skins for it? So that's why. All right, see you, Flame. Thanks for joining the stream. Welcome, snowman. Man, that tow truck's so cool. I, since that last episode, I put a uh, AAA skin on it. Carrying a knife. Oh, what? Oh, man, they just spawned on top of us. Drop the knife. Drop the knife. Drop the knife. Shots fired. Drop the knife. All right, on the ground now. Looks like she's gonna comply after getting shot twice. What a spawn point that was. They spawned right on top of the car. Uh, we got one Penny in custody. She's gonna need some medical attention. She got shot. We got one suspect down from Penny. We'll go ahead, roll EMS out to our location. She's got a Pikachu plushie on her person. Officers report a stabbing dispatch units from uh, El Barrow Heights, an ambulance requested from uh, Davis Hospital. Respond code three. Go ahead, request transport for her as well. Required. Proceed with patrol. Uh, you don't have to talk. I just do it to kind of role play. But there is a mod actually called Vocal Dispatch I used to have in the game. And you play, you press like a command on your controller, and um, doing so, the game would listen to you, and it would recognize certain verbal Thanks. commands, and it would do that. But um, I've since removed it. It got kind of glitchy later on. Looks like he's gonna be down, so we're gonna have to call the coroner out here, take uh, pictures. He, cause of death was a knife to the spine. To use visual dispatch, you don't, I mean, you need a, um, you do need a microphone. No, um, the, the Reno, it does not have any type of partition or separation from a suspect in you, so I always have to call in um, police transport to pick people up. See if the corner gets stuck or not. Have you ever gotten a t-shirt of myself? Yeah, I have a couple of times. It's pretty funny when that um, pops up. I bet the corner is not gonna make it. Probably have to call him again. Mayberry, she, she is... She's in the house. She's probably taking a nap. Yeah, it's a two-seater. 
Yep, we'll have to call the corner. It's getting stuck. Am I gonna get hit by the hurricane now? I'm far enough inland um, that it's just gonna be gust and heavy winds. <laughs> All right, corners here. They picked her up. You want to see Mayberry? Okay. I'll I'll go get her. I'll get her. Take ourselves off the call and then Alright, code four off of that one. Alright, hold on. I'll go get um Mayberry. Two seconds. back. You want to say hello, Mayberry? Come here. All right. You say hello. She was napping. <laughs> she was taking a nap. You were taking a nap. She said, why you wake me up? Yeah, don't don't talk about don't talk about crashes or what happened. Hey, pretty girl. Hi, old. Right. Thank you for joining us. All right, there's Mayberry. made her appearance all right we've been streaming about an hour probably go another um, 15 minutes or so I don't know why he's sitting there let's go ahead and clear the scene and we'll wait for another call out yeah, the last time someone mentioned a crash happening, the game crashed. <laughs> yeah, I know. Next time I go on um, K9 Patrol, I should just name it after my dog. Oh, we got a broken down vehicle. Let's go ahead and activate our emergency lights. Okay, that's good. Lincoln 18, we've got a, a broken down vehicle on US Route 20, headed northbound. We're gonna play check it, make sure it's not a stolen vehicle or anything like that. And if it's not, we will provide assistance if we can. Vehicle is occupied Our one time. Yeah, I'm not on the coast so, of South Carolina, so I don't have to worry. All right, let's go ahead and talk to the driver. I do want to get some ID off of him just to verify that he doesn't have warrants out. So let me. Well, let me stop and talk to him. Looks like it won't let me identify him, so <laughs> we'll go ahead and just attempt to repair. We'll we'll pretend like it's all um, fine. His war he doesn't have any warrants out or anything like that. So let's see if we can even repair his car for him. 
Sometimes we're able to, sometimes we're not. Oh, and apparently it was a very easy fix because he is on his way. Um, make sure you visit, visit a garage as soon as possible. Thank you, officer. Take care. All right. Yeah, th there are not too many emergency lights on this car. Citizens report a 503 in uh, El Barrow Heights. Look how far back in this car you sit. All right, uh, Lincoln 18, copy that. We've got a Grand Theft Auto in the area. I'm gonna go ahead and respond code three. What's gonna be the fastest way over there? Want to catch up? Grand Theft Auto is just a stolen vehicle. All right, I'm gonna drive as fast as I can over there. Without crashing, I'm gonna put this uh, track car to the test. But knowing me, I'm gonna crash into something and just nick the fence. Oh! Yeah, I definitely lose a little bit of control going around those corners. Those back wheels slide out pretty, pretty easily. Oh, he's on foot. Looks like he abandoned the car. Let's get some local backup. We have a 1099 in El Barrow Heights. We've got a one white male suspect running. He's in a dark tank top. Oh my gosh. Dark tank top and dark pants. Go ahead and block him off here. Going for the tackle. All right, freeze. Taser was effective. Stop you're under arrest. You're On the ground now, you're under arrest. Taxpayers gas as intended. <laughs> That's pretty accurate. All right, we got a Carlos Peach in custody here. We'll go ahead and search him, see if you have anything on him. Really? He was one in connection with the Grand Theft Auto. I don't know where exactly the stolen vehicle was. Oh, look, somebody was asking if I'd ever gotten my own t-shirt. There you go. Officer first 30 minutes t-shirt and a pair of gloves. Yeah, it happens. All right, um, we'll have to get transport out here, take him away. I do want to run Assistant his name. For a suspect placed under arrest. In Palomino Highlands. Carlos Peach. Roger. No active warrants. License is valid. How old am I? I'm uh, 25. There's a little FAQ down in um, the Twitch panels or whatever they're called. Answer some common questions I get. Alright guys, so it's been about an hour and ten minutes. We've been live. We're going to wind down the stream here. We're going to take uh, one last call out, I think, and then we're going to call it a day. Of course, this stream will be uploaded to YouTube. Just give it a couple hours and it will, it will come over there. You, you've missed like the majority of the patrol. <laughs> Attention unit. All right. Here's our last call out for today. We've got armed individuals in the area. I, I can already see him from. Suspect is. 
I can see him from this distance. We're gonna head out on foot, I think. Kind of surveil the scene. There's um, at least one armed individual standing in the roadway. Looks like he's got some type of body armor. Oh, we got shots fired. One officer, oh my gosh. I got caught up on that guy. One officer responded and taking fire. We've got an exploit. Oh man, I'm getting attacked. Hey man, just, that was my fault. All right. Oh, we got a headshot on him. When will your next live stream be? I'm not sure. I really don't have a set schedule. I do try to announce it on Twitter, Facebook. I upload a video um, on YouTube wanting notifying people I'm live. So let's go ahead and get some bears here. I believe the scene's secure. I think it was just this one individual acting alone. So we'll go ahead and call EMS to the scene. Attention all units. Medical We've got one officer down as well. Officers report an officer shot. We have multiple injuries. Dispatch units from um, Elbero Heights. An ambulance request. Undercover Camara. I've actually done an undercover Camara before. If if you ever have or are curious if I've done a patrol with a certain car, if you go to my YouTube channel page and just search my uploaded videos, it should um, if I've done it before pull up a video. I'm pretty good about tagging cars when I use them. Man, people are still driving through the barriers. Pick up this gun. Alright, come on. Come on, man. Go through. Oh, he's flicking me off. Great. Go through. People don't see the barriers or they don't care. Look, he's still trying to go around. All right, let's see what the report is. Um, unfortunately, it looks like the suspect is going to be transported to the hospital, and our officer is uh, not going to make it. Why don't I last longer in stream? I don't know, typically I, I just stream about an hour. It's normally how long how long my streams are. Alright, we'll get the corner out to our location. All units respond. Hey, 5252 coming in with a one dollar donation. He says Ed, <laughs> I don't know what the message is, but I uh, appreciate it. Thank you, Ed. All right, we're waiting on corner to come to the scene. I need to remove these barriers because this ambulance is not not uh, able to drive around them. You use face cam on YouTube. I probably I don't think I'll ever do that. Probably just for streams. You made the corner van a Mercedes Sprinter. Um, I believe that's an option, but I actually really like the van I have now. It's a GMC Express. It's a pretty cool car. It's got an amber light bar on it as well. Where are the corners? No dead bodies detected. Interesting. For some reason it's not detecting him as a dead body. Hey, 5252 donated six dollars and sixty cents. Wow, six dollars and sixty six cents. If I donate a hundred dollars, will you make a crazy cop episode? Is his comment. I'm not sure if I'll ever do that. I get a lot of requests to do an episode like that, like a bad cop type videos, but I'm not sure. But I appreciate the donation and the message. Alright guys, I think we're going to conclude it for today's stream. I want to thank you to all the donators, um, everybody who watched the stream live. I appreciate the support. If you follow the Twitch stream, if you subscribe on YouTube, it all helps me out. 
Um, this video will be uploaded on YouTube if you missed any part of it. Maybe you came in late to the stream and you want to catch what happened during the first part of the stream. Next time I'll live stream. Um, I'm not sure, but like I said, follow on Twitter, follow on Facebook. Um, if you're subscribed to me on YouTube, I will upload a video letting people know when I'm live. All right, guys, I appreciate you watching. Uh, thanks for joining me on this Friday night and um, hope everybody stays safe out there from the hurricane. And I'll see you guys on the next patrol. Thank you.